opinions and stories around the game we love told by your favorite storytellers. Stay up to date with all things cricket. Subscribe to Crick Buzz's YouTube channel and press that bell icon now. The other day we mentioned when Patidar and Kohli were batting together that inside the helmet there's just a slight tinge of a resemblance. That's where the resemblance ends. Ajay, if you compare their performances in the season, Patidar has just had seven innings and he's got uh, 333 runs. Virat Kohli has played every single game and he's got almost the same amount of runs, 341 in 16 innings at a yeah. strike rate of 115. Yeah, I mean, it, it'd be unfair to, you know, compare these two. I mean, it's a bit too early for Patidar to be even, you know, be compared to. I mean, I think he's a fabulous player and he has a great future. But I think... Let me Kohli's... just clarify. We weren't trying to compare the yeah, two, yeah, but no, it was I, just I the story of Kohli's season. Yeah. That a guy, a young kid who comes, who looks a bit like him, only in seven innings, gets yeah. the same number of runs. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I'm sure. I mean, the young kid who's come has, you know, at least shown glimpses of what he could be. I mean, when, you know, maybe I would look at it that, you know, when Kohli was a young man, if he came in, what you saw. But uh, probably the worst season that Kohli's had. I mean, uh, I, I can't remember a time where Kohli struggled to, you know, find one run at a time because there was a period in the middle where three, four games where he was not even getting that one run off. And it's bound to happen, you know, for somebody who's had a career such an illustrious career and, you know, probably the best player that we've seen for, you know, a decade or so. Uh, you know, he had his worst season and uh, Patidar probably has had his best season because don't forget, Patidar was around last year as well. He had four innings last year and he got, what, 40 odd in the whole total. So, there are times that you have, you know, a great time and Patidar is, you know, I, I, I look at him as a player of the future for sure. But, uh, you know, Kohli's had the worst uh, season, so I would not even go close to anywhere around Kohli. And I mean, you can't assess Kohli on, on a year like this. I mean, it's it's been a terrible year. Yes, if it hadn't been for Kohli, I can say that as well. Anybody else, uh, by the time he got that 70-odd, had it been anyone else in the Indian cricket as well, would have probably been rested by then. But uh, it's Virat Kohli and he will come back stronger. I mean, we, we, nobody's ever doubted the man's pedigree, the man's class. But Michael, just looking back at some of the, the ways he's found to get himself out in this season, and today was an example. I mean, there were players who were beaten by the ball. You think of Hasaranga getting out to that absolute peach of a Yorker. It would have got anyone in the world out. But Virat Kohli didn't get that. He had one miles outside the off stump and he just wafted at it almost, I mean, like an orchestra conductor and sent it straight to Sanju Samson. <laughs> Yeah, it, it happens. You know, he's a, a legendary player that's just going through a time that it's not not so easy. Two or three years ago, we all just turned on the telly or arrived at the ground and we just knew Virat was going to get 100. He just went through one of those periods where every time he batted, he seemed to get 100. Well, at the minute, it's it, it's a career, isn't it? You don't go through your whole career where everything is so easy. Uh, he just needs a breather for me. I just think he needs a bit of time away from the game. Uh, go and spend some time with the family. Uh, refresh, get on the plane to England and then then start to hit some balls again. Um, you know, these players play so much and they're under so much pressure every single day of their lives that it's inevitable that eventually, you know, you go through a period where you, you struggle a little bit and that's that's what's happening to Virat. Um, he, he's too good a player not to bounce back and come back and he'll have one of those periods again like we saw a few years ago where he got so many centuries on the trot. Um, it, it's just that little bit harder at the minute and he's got to work so hard to get back into form but when he gets the bat back in his hand at the minute i think he should just pack his bat into his bag and just go and have a breather <laughs> go and have a sit down with the family go on a bit i don't know where you can go without getting hassled and pestered and doing commercials just get away from all that stuff just go and have a few weeks and chilling and and then he'll be a, a little bit fresher next time he picks up his bat